Way, hello there, it's Green and welcome to another speed build, which if you think about it, it's the last speed build of the decade, but we're not going to talk about that because that's kind of a scary thought. So I wanted to do a Christmas park, like a city Christmas park, you know, a park in the city that they've decorated for Christmas with a tree and maybe some shops. Last year I did a huge Christmas village and it was fun. But it wasn't that much of a fun because it was very tiresome, it took me forever to do it and I kinda midway through got bored of it and I never visited to be honest with my sims because they take the park takes forever to load the lot uh, because it's, it's big, it's big, it's very heavy. So I was like, I, I don't wanna do that this year and I wanted to do a city park. So, the ad, I am assuming this is something that happens all around the world, that, you know, usually on December 1st, here they uh, do a big ceremony in the city, in essentially the main park of the city, or here it's like the main city square, where they light up the tree and the shops open, like, you know, the small Christmas village shops, and they have bands and everything. And I wanted to do something similar to that, but you know, in a smaller scale. And I had this idea, I wasn't sure how I wanted to do it, but I wanted to have a nice big tree and have some shops and ice skating. Ice skating is something that I love. Uh, I'm not good at it, I'm nowhere no, no good at it, but I really like it. And here we only have like ice skating for kids, like an ice skating ring that's only accessible to kids because it's this small so we don't have the chance to go ice skating and it's something that i really like so i really wanted to add it to the park so i went through google images and i was trying to find you know inspiration so i got the basics down a stage uh for obviously like the concert or the band that was going to sing the ice skating park and the tree and all the rest you know, it was up to inspiration. And I found this so pretty, so, so pretty, like, park. And it was sunken down, like, as you can see here, the ice skating ring was sunken down, and then you had the stage for the band that was still sunken down, but higher than the rest of the sunken down things. And then you had the tree, which was up top, and I'm like, that's so pretty. Like, that's so unbelievably pretty. That's what I want to do. And I also had in mind that I wanted to do, because obviously it's a city, I wanted it to be accessible from, like, subway, metro, however you call it where you're from. And I know, like, the gang doesn't obviously have subways and metros, I guess. It kind of doesn't say the living, but I wanted, you know, that idea. So I wanted the metro to be sunken down. As you can see here, that didn't really happen. So I went with more of a London style metro, which I really like the end result of it. It turns out pretty cool. You have one on the left, one on the right for symmetry reasons. And then as I started, you know, making the park, and going through the images, I realized that the park that I was seeing and I loved so much was Rockefeller Center, which was a name that I heard before. I'm following um, Swarovski on Instagram and it's here they're like, oh, the big Swarovski crystal star uh, is once again up on the Christmas tree on Rockefeller Center. I'm like, I never really paid much attention. To it like I never really care I just scrolled past it but because I've read it so many times I recall like you know that this is what they say every year essentially and I never really thought of what Rockefeller Center was but in my mind it was like a big mall maybe that was like the big tree in the middle and you had like all these shops and maybe some businesses and stuff like that and then I'm like I saw that says Rockefeller Center I'm like wait no, this is Rockefeller Center? A park? And I'm like, wait, wait up, that, that's wrong. <laughs> so I went to Google search, and I'm like, I searched Rockefeller Center, and I'm like, that's it. And I was so underwhelmed. 
I don't know why, like originally I loved it so much and I'm sure like in real life it's amazing and so beautiful. But you know, I don't know, just in my mind it was so much bigger, it wasn't like a small thing. Which again, maybe the pixels make that. But yeah, essentially this entire lot is almost mirrored from Rockefeller Center, which I didn't even realize at first. So this is the stage and I think it was on Rockefeller Center or at least I got inspired by it. They had like waterfalls behind it and I'm like, oh, that's pretty. So I added these fountains and I had this idea because as you can see, the stage slopes down, not the stage, the ice skating ring slopes down. I wanted to cover the exposed ground somehow. And what I decided to do was, you will see it a bit later, I will use some, an item essentially, and I will use the tool mod to slope it. And I think it looks so good. So here I really wanted to make it look like a stage um, and added the lights because, you know, obviously you need to have lights, but because these lights are so freaking tall, I had to add them from the basement. So they are, you know, a normal height and not that high, if that makes sense. So yeah, and I added two stores. Originally I wanted at least four and as you saw in the beginning, I added some glass domes, which I saw, I think it was, mm, let's see, I can easily find it. It was in a country park, like Christmas park. And I'm like, ah, that's so pretty. Let's find it, let's find it. Yeah, in Lithuania. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Like they have these glass domes uh, instead of shops and it looks amazing but as you can see i couldn't fit it here i was so sad so i had to go with uh the stools or the stands yeah the food stands food stools food stands i'm not sure uh from like the packs i decided to go eventually we'll see that i will change them with the ones from um uh, university the one is red the other one is blue and i'm like yes it looks perfect also, as you can see, I didn't mention it before, but the tree is decorated with snowballs. You saw me decorate it. And the reason why is when you decorate the tree, like uh, the one that came with seasons that it's not pre-decorated, and when you enlarge the tree, the decorations remain in the same place. And I didn't want to use the already decorated tree because it wasn't first that elegant, and second, I feel like everyone is using that. So I'm like, I wanted to have like a star on the top and from the star, I got the idea to use as balls, the snowballs and a snowflake as a star. And I think it turns out super cute. Like I'm so proud of it. So proud of it. Um, what else? Oh yeah, the stage, as you can see currently, I tried so many times and I will try again later. Uh, I hate the fact that the stage is sloping, like you can see, exposed ground from the stage to the ice skating ring. And what I tried to do, but I didn't succeed, was to make it, you know, as a raised foundation. But I couldn't get it done. And eventually, magically, I don't know how, it gets done. But I was so annoyed because I couldn't, I couldn't do it. So, I wanted to use the other ones, you saw I had four pulled, uh, two were brick, not, not brick, concrete, that I think they match the area way better, because, you know, obviously it's a city park, so concrete works way better, but they didn't, like, slope, I used the uh, tool mod again to uh, rotate it and elevate the uh, dividers, the room dividers from dine out, and the elevate thing, or not the elevate, the rotate thing, if you do it in the X, I think, is it like axis? It didn't work, which is annoying, so I had to use this. But they, I think the end result looks cool. Also, I was so annoyed with the stairs. I don't know why, but when I wanted, obviously, to add stairs from the, I guess, metro, if you want, to the stage and I cannot add the stairs anywhere else apart from this spot and as you can see they intersect with the ground I don't know why like I tried expanding the stairs it didn't work I tried adding stairs um, elsewhere it didn't hear it is 
why all of a sudden it worked then? I'm like, I don't get it, but I'm happy that it did because it works way better. Uh, what annoyed me was obviously the elevation and the angle of the dividers had to be different. Uh, so it, it, it looked very weird and I wasn't really happy with that. And all of a sudden it worked and I'm like, yes, I don't know how it worked, but I'm happy with it. Um, and I had this room, no, light, I don't know what, the things that I added behind the tree, can't think of the word currently, uh, but yeah, I had them behind, not behind, like in the shades, and I had stringed them then down, but they look very weird because the light doesn't shrink, so I'm like, that sucks, uh, but I added them behind the tree and they work really well in the screenshots, I think they look great. Um, what else? Oh yeah, at this point I realized that the entire thing, it's perfect. To me, I love it. It's very simple, it has a lot of character, and I realized that it has no toilets, and I'm like, well, fuck, <laughs> I don't know where to put them. Um, so yeah, I decided to ignore that issue and work on the stage, so I wasn't sure because at least here we have like the city band singing on like the tree lighting but also we go into the same uh, area or I guess stage, um, square, however you want to call it and we do New Year's, that's why I decided to post it on New Year's Eve essentially all, you know, as in New York you have like the ball drop, here we go essentially to the city square and you have fireworks and like singers and bands singing so I wasn't sure what I wanted to want in the States and because we don't have a lot of band items I decided to simply go with a piano I feel like it looks more elegant and you can easily you know skate around with a piano and someone singing so yeah that's why I decided to do and went with. Also, I wanted to add like a metro beneath it to make it look more realistic. However, the series didn't fit, which was a blessing because later I realized with all the different levels, I wouldn't be able to make the metro work um, because it would be in a basement and yeah, very different levels. So yeah, this is everything. I really hope you enjoyed it and you like it because I definitely had fun making it. And I hope that you'll have an amazing New Year's Eve. And yeah, cheers to better 2020. Bye!